brothers and sisters, put your hands together for a pop. yesterday, I hadn't seen him in a while yesterday, but you know, when he greeted me, I'm happy to see him and all that, and so he said out of his mouth, like, yeah, I know you haven't seen me in a while, right, but you know, I didn't, I was like, oh man, well you here now, brother, all praise due to Allah, <laughs> and so, and he, so he said, uh, yeah, man, you know, Every now and then I still get a little craving for, you know, White Castle or Burger King. I think he even mentioned McDonald's, right? <laughs> you know, and I didn't discourage him, right? You know, in fact, I just paused. I'm shaking my head, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I learned how to listen, like, you know? Because there's more you want to say, right? <laughs> so I just paused. And he said, yeah, you know. I really want to get to a point, man, where I'm just leave that stuff alone all together, man, and, you know, eat more healthy, man, eat more healthy, you know, I, so that's what I wanted to hear, right, <laughs> I said, yes, sir, yes, sir, so that was an opportunity to welcome to my book, right, <laughs> I said, look, let me show you something, man, I, you know, a lot of me to write this book, now, my situation was drug abuse, right, but look, come look at these steps. So he sat down and um, <laughs> see the first step is you got to make a decision. Mm. <laughs> so I opened it up to that, make a decision to the uh, table of contents. Right? You got to make a decision, man. You know, you right there. All you got to do is make a decision. But, you know, then the second step, find the love, right? <laughs> you also got to find the love. Look, man. So I sat down with him. No, I didn't sit down. I leaned on the table and was like, you know, back, man, when I was going through what I was going through, man, with the crack, man, and the PCP and all that, man. You know, when I finally got up to a point where I'm making a decision to change my life, man, find the love, man. Find the love. I said, man, you got to find the love, man. You know, at that point in my life, I couldn't even find 10 things to write down that I loved about myself. He looked, man, he was like, he said, you wrote this book? <laughs> like, yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, man. And then I was like, man, see, you ask most people, do you love yourself? Man, most people are going to be like, yeah, of course I do. I mean, what do you mean, do I love myself? Of course I love myself, man. Yeah, but then when you say, okay, well, how? How do you love yourself? Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> People get stuck there, like, why do you love yourself? Like, or now, can you take that statement? Because that's lip service right there. Yeah, I love myself. You know what I'm saying? Five a cigarette. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I love myself. Uh -huh. Then you go and uh, get you a forty, or then you probably don't even drink forties no more. <laughs> get you a shot of Hennessy or whatever, whatever the case, whatever y'all drinking today. I don't know. I don't even know. But and not only that, you drink until you drunk. 
<laughs> but you love yourself, right? Uh-huh. I know. So, and so he was amazed, man. Like, I was I was honored for sure. Like, because it's a blessing, man, to be able to use your own life, man. So, uh, point, point the thing. And the point that I was making, you know, this book specifically is about my journey through drug abuse. However, you can take these same steps to deal with that fast food thing you got going on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> or whatever it is, you know? It's still things that I can use to book for, yeah. I ain't, I ain't perfect, you know? But I'm grateful. And then another brother come in with his uh, queen and uh, heard me, overheard me talking to the brother. And this, this really touched me because he said, he said to me, Said, brother man i'm getting a lot out of that book you know i when at sight i didn't even know he had purchased the book from out there he said man i'm getting a lot out of that book man you know when things clear up man i want to set up some platforms man hey you come talk to some people about that man you know and that really that really made me feel pretty good because you know just to hear those words i'm getting a lot out of that book you know what I'm saying? Hey, what is it all for? You know what I'm saying? My whole thing is I don't want to take the information to the grave when I could have used it to help somebody. You know what I mean? So, huh. That's our word today. From the death of Apocalypse. Man, make a decision, man, then move out on it, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is. That's what life's all about. All right? Enjoy your day. Peace. Ain't no stopping us now. Ain't no stopping us now. We on the move. You dig? <laughs>